What's going on guys, it's Danny here and I'm gonna play Ability Draft. I'm playing Ability Draft, I got Magnus as a hero and my first pick was Blade Dance because I want to make it carry. <laughs> Simple as that, I want to make Magnus carry. I can't tab out right now, I can't go to the main menu because there is no option. Um, a lot of things are still left to be fixed in Ability Draft. Um, but when the game starts, we will make sure we take a look at the talents. And I'm sure the talents are good to make a carry. I think Magnus has an attack speed talent and also a damage talent, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure he has attack speed and damage. So we are going to choose those kind of talents and we're gonna go for Magnus carry. Now, what's my ultimate? I could still get RP. I don't see why not. Doesn't matter that I am playing ability draft. Or I could get Eye of the Storm. Or I could get Empower. Empower is amazing. Oh, somebody took it. Shit. I really wanted it. Or Natural Order, I think. Your turn to pick. Let's get this one. It's a second passive. I don't want to have all passives though. Base armor reduction and base resist reduction. Yeah, reducing the armor should be really good so I can hit harder. Omni slash is taken. Okay, let's get Eye of the Storm. You know what? You let's get Eye of the Storm. Because getting getting RP would be like very similar to the real Magnus. And that's not exactly what I want. If I wanted to play carry Magnus, I could queue for um, unranked all pick game, pick Magnus and build carry and play as a carry. But I'm playing ability draft though. And one more spell after this. Let me see what they have. They have two melee heroes, three ranged. Um, not many targetable spells. The unstable current won't be very good pick. They have blinks, blink strike that you know unstable current will proc. It also has a nice passive, of course, for bonus speed, but also I'm looking to make use of the of the procs that slow and deal damage. So they have only Blink Strike and um, Reaper Scythe. Only two spells. So I'm gonna get something else instead. What's good to get if it's not Unstable Current? Maybe a dual breath for slow, because I don't have any slows, actually. Your turn to pick. Yeah, dual breath should be decent for slows. And it can kind of carry me through the early game, you know what I mean? Because magic damage and good spells that are good early carry you through the early game. And of course, for later, I have amazing... I'm, I have amazing uh, things for later. I have Blade Dance, you know, Natural Order and Eye of the Storm. Prepare for battle. Oh my god, yep. 25 attack speed on level 10 and 50 damage on level 15 seems good. Level 20, 15 strength seems really good because it gives HP and damage. And then on level 25, uh, minus 35 second respawn time. Because shockwave cooldown, I don't have shockwave. Let's go towards mid. Maybe I could start with the killing blade here. Got my tangos and my killing blade. I could easily go mid. 30 seconds to battle. Wait. Elder Titan has two ultimates? Huh? Elder Titan has two ultimates. 
He has his own ultimate and uh, the ultimate he picked. I guess he picked Winter's Curse, but he also has his ultimate. The battle begins. What the fuck? Hello. Hello. So, what I could do here is maybe I could go Battle Fury to compensate for not having cleave. Okay, I'm pulling these creeps back over here. You get your creeps. Where are you going with the creeps? He doesn't want to go under the tower with the creeps, but me neither because last hitting under the tower is, you know, a bit weird. You may miss a lot of last hits under the tower. It's much better to have the lane creeps. Alright. Yeah, maybe I could go Battle Fury this game, I don't know. Battle Fury is not bad. I mean... If I took RP as an ultimate... I would most likely go Battle Fury, but since I don't have RP, hmm, I don't really need to. Oh man, those crits already. I have a cooling blade and those crits are amazing. I have pretty good damage. I have 61 damage and I have a cooling blade, so yeah, should be able to get a lot of farm from this mid lane and also I need to deal some harassment to this guy maybe I should get a basher this game not maybe I will get a basher I will get dragon lance by the way I mean sorry <laughs> not dragon lance um, echo saber I am definitely getting echo saber this game and also basher is good Maybe, maybe a Skadi? Nah, uh, I don't know. We'll see. I have crit though. It's amazing that I don't have to buy crit. I already have crit. Is he gonna try to... Are you trying to fight me or something, bro? I hit hard, bro. Yeah, go away. Find if I hold in. What does he have exactly? Let me check. Oh, he's like a tinker. Necrovolt is basically a tinker. He has rearm, march, missile. The only difference is that he has death balls. But Death, Death Pulse won't benefit much from rearms because Death Pulse has very low cooldown already. Long cooldown spells is what benefit the most from rearm. Very long cooldown spells. So Necrophos is basically a tinker here. Eh. Very interesting, man. Very fun. You are so fun. See, I don't have a single spell of my hero. I have all spells from different heroes. Because we're playing ability draft. Come here, creeps. Come over here. I want to farm you. Maybe I could go Helm of the Dominator. The new Helm of the Dominator is amazing. In most cases. Last hit? Nice. I'm getting all the last hits. Okay, let's get one of those infused raindrop for some mana region. 
and survive some magic nukes. I'm maxing dual breath because, as I said, the uh, magic damage, the magic spells, is what's going to carry me through the early and mid game. The the dual breath damage and slow, together with Eye of the Storm, is a really good early and mid game. Really good for early and mid game fights, you know. And uh, for the fights later, I have the crit and the natural order. It is very good. I have decent early, mid game, and late game. Not bad build, not bad. Should be pretty fun this one, guys. Fucking. Never mind. This guy is pressuring the lane a lot with the... Uh... If he goes for the top rune, I kill him. He has to go for the top rune, right? It's a haste, too. Your haste. middle tower is under attack. Uh, I don't want to do this. How does it happen that exactly now, like not earlier, exactly now is when a teammate of his rotates mid? If this Tinker wasn't there, I would have killed him for sure. How does it happen that now exactly the Tinker is gonna be there? <laughs> Holy shit. Feels bad, man. That was actually my kill. That was supposed to be my free kill on the Necro. Oh wait, what is going on there? Oh, March Machines. I think he's maxing the March Machines because they hurt a lot. And that's not fun. Not only you pick like an annoying ass Tinker, because Tinker is a super annoying hero. Not only you pick like Tinker, you also max the march machines come on what the hell is wrong with you yeah take some fire and some ice My hooves are my Fuck. how long until the shrine no shrine I'm gonna need a healing cell. I think we're getting Echo Saber Shadow Blade this game. And that will be good for ganking, killing stuff. Take my and my pike. Oh, the crit. Oh. Them last hits, yo. Them last hit the Rhinos under the tower. He's probably farming jungle or an, on Necro. Maybe Necro is farming jungle. No, he's bottom. Come with me. Maybe we can find a kill. Look at that. Bro, where is your Tinker now? Uh oh. I don't have anything to cancel TP. <laughs> where is your Tinker? Well, you don't need your Tinker apparently because you just TP out in front of me. Hey, Ricky. Hey, Oracle. Where is the Oracle at? Is he like gonna TP out as well? Most likely. Uh, DMD four. There is a Juggernaut here. What are you up to, Juggernaut? What are you doing, man? He has a spin and uh, what's it called? Empower. Spin and empower. 
There should be a bottom shrine very soon, yeah, 20 seconds. Maybe I could go use that one. Using the bot shrine and coming bottom. Nice, we got a smoke. Here. Got a kill. Was it worth your life to try for my own? Um, I don't know. Yeah, my ultimate is still going. Get him, get him. My ultimate is strong. I hope Oracle doesn't have anything to kill me. Thank you. Radiant structures are fortified. My ultimate is strong. My ultimate deals good damage. How about a desolator this game? Because my ultimate is physical damage. And natural order? Okay, what does it do exactly? It says base armor reduction. On level 4, it's 100%. So, 325 radius. Basically, when I'm on melee range to someone. Um, basically, it makes their base armor to zero. So, if I make desolator, I will have... Um, they will have, like, negative armor. Natural order makes it to zero and desolator reduces it by six or so seven actually seven armor reduction Hey tinker What's up man? Oh that damage Holy shit my damage is sick Actually, natural order will be much better than I expected. Much, much better than I expected. Especially in a combination with Eye of the Storm. And you know what I'm thinking here? 15% spell amplification. It says spell amplification. So every spell deals 15% more damage. No matter um, if it's physical or magical damage right it's just spell amplification every spell deals more damage no matter what type of damage it is 25 attack speed is pretty nice but the spell amplification will buff my ultimate and i won't really have problems with you know having attack speed it's not it's not something that big probably i'm just gonna do this like, I'm just going, you know, just trying out. Trying things out. And let's go Desolator, as I said. So, with Spell Amplification, the ultimate deals more damage. With Natural Order, because of the armor reduction, it deals more damage. Oh my god, look at this guy. This guy is just fucking dead. Okay. And with Desolator, it will deal more damage. Should be pretty nice. I just want to farm on just want to farm some items whenever i get the opportunity to i will go for kills but i think mostly i want to farm items it would be good if i don't miss last hits thank you um my ultimate's on cooldown for 20 seconds i will tip it up and we can fight just need my ultimate. 
Oh shit. I don't know why I bought so many TPs. Okay, going. Can we TP with more? Nice. Bro, you're not that fast. I slowed you. And my ultimates hits you. Your middle tower is under attack. What does the Aghanim Scepter do exactly? Does it increase the duration? Causes faster strikes, faster, and damage structures. Oh wow, the Aghanims is pretty decent here. Oh shit, I should have tried to last hit the tower. <laughs> Never mind, I was reading my Aghanims. So the Aghanims is pretty decent for the ultimate. Maybe I could make Aghanims. Ricky, we're coming for you. Oh my god, he's running bottom. Yep. Okay, I'm farming. I got great mana region. From the Echo Saber, I have decent mana region. I can use the spells. Spells to push. Now, on level 15, I'm definitely choosing the 50 damage. Because remember, apart from my strong spells and my strong ultimate, I right click with blade dance. So, 50 damage is good. Very good. Who is this? What are you doing? Bro, what are you doing? You don't have laser. You don't really have laser, bro. You are acting like a tinker, but you are not exactly a tinker. You don't have fucking laser. So you can't really kill me. Okay, let's go base. There is a nice rune there for a spellcaster. Whoever has spells. Low, low cooldown spells, the arcane rune will make them even lower cooldown and spammable and less mana cost. Damn, what does this oracle have? He's dominating. Mask of Madness with... Oh, Perma Invis and Nether Toxin. And he has a talent for experience gain. And Oracle has pretty decent right click, to be honest with you. Oracle's right click is alright. Your top tower is under attack. Which my prize. Let's farm mid, I guess. Definitely 50 damage talent, better than the fourth point on Blade Dance. It only increases the chance by 5%. 50 damage is much better than 5% more crit. with more people and fight. Fuck. Never mind, I'm backing. I'm trying to. I thought we could maybe fight there, but... Your bottom tower has fallen. Their five men seems to be too strong. Holy shit. Your bottom tower is under attack. And they are getting another tower.
Hope everyone is doing good today, by the way. Hope you're having a good day. We gotta carry this game, though. We have to be the savior for our team here. Is that the word I'm looking for? Yeah, should be that. Savior? I think I know what savior is. Should be that for my team. I'm gonna try my best to carry. Since I have a carry build, you know. Since I went for a carry build. And I went mid lane. I gotta make use of the carry build and actually carry. It's just, um, it's just they are pretty strong and they are, I don't know, they are not going YOLO, they are not going crazy. Now Oracle is alone middle, if I had Shadow Blade, this could have been an easy gank, but I need Dust as well because he has Invis. I need to carry this. I need to carry this Dust, Dust thingy. Nobody is buying the Tome of Knowledge, so I will do. I will do that. Nobody wants Tomes. Man, my damage is really good, but I will probably get disabled or killed by magic spells, magic damage. Maybe I need BKB later. Getting BKB in ability draft, mm, not happening. I don't know if I, I don't know if I want to do that. It doesn't work on heroes. Natural order doesn't work on heroes, or what's going on here? can't reach the Ricky. I, I'm really not an Elder Titan player. Not at all. So I really don't know that much. Your bottom tower is under attack. I'm assuming it works on heroes, but I'm not sure. Because in the description it says uh, nearby enemy units, you know? Units means heroes as well. Okay. I will be able to make stuff happen with the Shadow Blade. Right now, Invis Rune will do well as well. Invisibility. Your top tower is under attack. Is there a bounty rune here? Nope. Anyone farming jungle here? Nope. But Oracle is farming middle. So maybe with the dust, we can kill him. Holy shit! <laughs> okay. Okay. I realized it. Nice. So, basically what I said is... What I said I will do works. It's, it's working. 
because I deleted that oracle. Natural order is reducing the ba the base armor, and then my desolator is reducing more armor. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Very good. That's exactly what we want, right? This is gonna be a fun game. Holy shit, this is gonna be a fun game. Hell yeah. Magnus Carry in the house. Magnus Carry in the ha house. That oracle could be a problem. Um... He has a lot of kills, so if we continue ganking him and killing him, it would be amazing. He activated Mask of Madness. Now it expired, though. I kill him in two hits! I kill him in two hits! Nice! Double damage! Come at me, whoever is here, casting March Machines. Come at me, bro. Don't run away from me. Don't run away from me. Oh, hit him one more time. Oh my god. I couldn't hit him one more time. He skewered away. My teammates are trying to save my life. Oh my god, that's some nice combos right there. Holy shit, the Wombo Combo. The enemy's middle tower has fallen. Basher next. We're gonna get a Silver Edge, and then we're gonna get a Basher. Um, we want ganks, we want to kill people. My. We want to kill people. I would assume enemies are farming jungle right now. Or they should be? Nope, they are top. Now, does the 15% spell amplification increase the crit of my blade dance? There are so many things that make make you like, hmm. Hmm. Will this work that way? And will that work like this? So instead of 200%, the crit damage is 215%. Does it work like that? I really have no idea. What if they come here and they gank me with 5 people? I would expect such hate because I'm having a really good game, so if they focus me, I won't be surprised. But it's alright. Enemy's bottom tower has fallen. It's okay, because we're gonna own them. Now they are starting to carry sentries. <laughs> Ricky has sentries. Not gonna save you from me, bro. Sentry's not gonna save you. Sentry not gonna save you from the Magnus. The carry Magnus. Take my pardon and my pike.
30 minute rune, double damage? Nope. <laughs> Illusion. Nope. Illusions. No double damage for me. Valve doesn't like me enough. How do you make Valve like you so it give so they give you double damage runes all the time? What do you do? I think I'm gonna have to peace out. Because they are too many here. Nice, we get a pick off on the Tinker, that's amazing. I'm gonna need some heals. Can you cold embrace me once? Waiting for my heal. Thanks. Two shot. <laughs> the poor Oracle. I think we're gonna make this Oracle rage quit, guys. It's such a squishy hero with so low armor and I have Desolator. Disgusting. Making my way downtown, walking fast and I'm gonna kill everyone. Man, that damage on towers is sick. Need heals, thanks. I need healing! Reinhardt in Overwatch, screaming. I need healing! I require medical attention. I have 3000 HP, I just noticed. <laughs> and I have crazy damage, I just noticed. Oh, don't worry, I too shot this guy. Bruh! No! Can you call them? Brace me. Fuck. How I wish I had the minus 35 second respawn time right now. So I respawn faster. And it doesn't take forever. I almost killed all of them there. Almost killed all of them. Triple kill. You know it's a good draft when I get triple kills in a 1v3, 1v3 2v4 situation, something like that. Uh, the, la the last one, remember the, the last week's ability draft video, that juggernaut with duel, the duel knot. Holy shit, that was crazy. But not every single ability draft game can be that epic, unfortunately. I wish all of them were like that, but, well. Take more than death 
Let's tip it up. Coming. I think I used my invis a bit too early. It's going to run out very soon. Shit. I actually may need to buy a BKB this game. I think to carry this game we need a BKB. Juggernaut takes a bit more to kill. He doesn't die as fast as Oracle, for example. The two Rampages. Need to get Rampage in this one too, that would be great. But the two Rampages last week though. Holy <laughs> shit. Some epic stuff. I think I don't need to use Dual Breath anymore. In, in, in the casting time of Dual Breath, I could be hitting instead. Since I have Basher, I could be just auto attacking and wrecking with auto attacks. Let's get the bottom tier too. Hey Tinker. No no no, come back, come back, don't uh he's just running away. I think he's very fast because of uh Yule Scepter and unstable current. Tinker has a lot of movement speed. He bought a lot of movement speed items and he picked that spell that gives movement speed. The passive spell that I was gonna pick, but I don't benefit much from it, so. Put the have dust in your inventories. I don't have slots. Fucking march machines. I get enough tinkers in games. What is this? Tinker is the most annoying thing to push against. It's actually so annoying. Oh my god. So these people decide, we're gonna play ability draft and we're gonna act like we're playing Tinker in a real Dota game. We're gonna spam March Machines to defend towers. Nice. You know what's even more aids? You know what I played against yesterday? I played against Techies and Kotal. The game was 30 minutes longer than it should have been. It was so annoying to push against. We won, and thank god we won. Because we won the laning phase really, really, like really hard. We owned them in the laning phase really hard. But it was so annoying to break the high ground because Techies mines and Kotal spells. Techies overall is that kind of hero. He can extend the game a lot and make it very difficult to push. And if you make mistake if you make some mistakes while you're pushing, it can cost you the game. If you run in and die to mines without buyback on your carries, something like that, it can definitely cost you the game. Mine. Being a 
Alright, let's fight, boys. It really sucks not having Aegis, but... I'm just gonna hit a bit and get out. Okay, I can't get out. I have BKB after this. I got the march machines. Nice. That Aegis was a bait. Je baited, boys. The Aegis was a bait. After the Aegis, I put my BKB in, in my inventory, activated. Destroy them. Oh my god. We really need to kill that fucker Necro. Can we finish the rocks? You guys ranged heroes can hit the rocks. My BKB is up. Come at me, you fucker! Necrofalls. Get fucked, Necrofalls. Acting like if you were a tinker. I got a bit annoyed from this game, not gonna lie. <laughs> I got a bit annoyed because of that March Machine spam. But we're good. We're good. We carried this. Don't worry. Don't worry, we got this. He keeps spamming his shit. Good thing it doesn't matter much because we have healing ward. What what would we do without a healing ward? That healing ward is so perfect. Increases duration. Okay. Makes sense. Now that makes sense. I was like, will that Ricky ever end his ultimate so I can kill him? It never ended. Because the Aghanims increases the duration. Holy shit. Aghanims increases the duration, I see. Cool. Let's get um Let's get the radiance actually. <clears throat> Give me a moment to polish my home. Not gonna see my radiance in in action. The game will end before that. It's fine. Doesn't matter. 
we did what we gotta do to win the game. We bought BKB. We owned them. Man, this almost seemed like a non-ability draft game. Almost. Because it wasn't very, very short and completely one-sided. It was actually a 40, 45 minutes game. And 5 minutes from the drafting phase, the entire video will be around 40... I mean, around 50 minutes. 52 minutes or so. Right now it's at 51. Um, so yeah, ability draft game for you right here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, the, the games, uh, yeah, I just wanted to mention something real quick. Uh, the games that are uploaded from stream obviously have no, no intro and outro from the stream b because they are from the stream, but, um, that doesn't mean, you know, I don't appreciate the likes and stuff. In on every video, the likes are really appreciated. They really help out a lot the, the video and the channel to keep growing. So that's why we all, people who upload on YouTube, be like, if you enjoy the video, hit the like button because it really does help. Just wanted to mention that because if there is no intro and outro, um, you know, that doesn't make the video worse in any way right if it's from the stream it doesn't really matter sometimes they are from stream sometimes they are recorded this one is recorded so it had an intro remember in the beginning so yeah thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you're new to my channel by the way feel free to subscribe i try my best to upload videos every day thank you for watching and i will see you again in the next video good luck and have fun playing video games.